Hello and welcome to Jobs 5 and Real Life Mods for GTA 5. Helby's 5.8 here and we're going to be playing some Grand Theft Auto like you would do in real life where you have to get a job, you have to make money, and then you have to buy stuff with the money you earn and you can't just steal it like a normal GTA. I hope this will be pretty insightful and pretty fun for other people to watch. And we'll also be doing a lot of stuff that deals with real life in the fact that um, you can't steal cars, you can't go over the speed limit, you can't harass people, you can't just hit people. Pretty much everything that GTA is about is like completely taken away in this real time li or real life mod, excuse me. So just sit back and enjoy and I'm going to make a couple of these and see how it goes and if it ends up being really really good I'll make a lot of them. But uh, our our first goal I guess is to make get a get a job, make a decent chunk of money and then find some kind of conveyance like a bike or a scooter or something or even maybe take the hit and steal a car we'll, but we'll see that, that we'll play it by ear see how long it takes to actually make some money and how many days it takes to make a decent a chunk of money to even buy something but I have removed all my weapons because this is one of my normal like single player saves for mods and I also do not have any money as you can see up here and it's currently Sunday so we'll watch how long it takes to do some of the jobs or whatever and put on the map here there are all these yellow dots we'll just run around and try to use a taxi probably get hit for not having any money and then getting rid of the uh, cops and stuff we'll have to deal with that for a little while until we get our own vehicle which will probably be hopefully sometime soon here but um i hope you enjoy and uh just sit back and watch and i'll try to do some commentary as i can and i gotta fix that up by michael's house but yeah, starting out, Michael is homeless, basically. No money, no cars, no guns, no nothing, no friends, no family. His, the original story doesn't apply here. This is just a complete, like, start over, technically. So we have no degree, no job, no salary to speak of, no special license. And then I can turn that on and off. And then I also have the real-life mod, which means if uh, I try to steal a car, cops will come after me. So I guess let's go see if we can find a job somewhere and try to get some kind of money in on this. Which, uh, I think this one is security guard, and then this one's pilot. I think pilot requires a degree or some kind of special license at least. And I don't know what some of these other ones are, but I guess we'll have to check out what they are. And eventually we could probably buy a gun or two. Not, not a lot, but enough to you know, like, defend ourselves in case something happens. The... I'm guessing that's the actor one that's in the mod. That's taxi driver that requires a license. I think that one's firefighter. Don't know what that one is, and then these are the two college ones. So it's basically these three right here, I don't know what they are. That one's probably a helicopter pilot because it's by the helicopter port. And then this is probably the waiter. That's the other one. Or this one's the waiter, I don't know. But I suppose we could try getting a job. Well, this one's closest, so let's go try that one first. And if that one doesn't work out, we'll walk down here or run, whatever, because I don't have a vehicle. And it's faster to run. Walk down here and try to get a decent paying rage and then make some money pretty quick because uh, some of these other ones are pretty terrible. You actually have to go do stuff. Like taxi driver, you actually have to drive people around and your fare dictates how much you make that day. Um, fireman, you don't really do anything I've seen. It's it's apparently like one of the worst dry jobs to do because it's not exactly working right now. But we'll, we'll see how that works out. But uh, yeah, I guess let's head over here and see if I can't get a job really quick. I guess let me know in the comments or on Twitter or something on if I should turn off the HUD and have it where there's nothing except for even with the menu off. Have no map, no nothing, just so you can't see. Oh, God, there's a car. Really, woman? Normal GTA, I would have pulled you out and killed you. Don't hit me. Stop it. Stop it. Ah. Damn it. She's going to hit me too. God. You're crazy. Oh man, 
People are terrible. Alright, so this is going to be a long run over to the port and the helicopter pad, I guess is what it's called. I forgot what it's called in story. I mean, I own it, but I forgot what the hell it's called. Oh well. Um, I'm just going to find a taxi, too. There's a taxi! Look at that! Taxi! Taxi, taxi, taxi. Or that one, whatever. Okay. That's kind of weird. Yeah, you can take us there. That works. Can you change the radio, dude? Please? Go change the radio. Come on. Change the radio. There. Let's just turn it off. Come on. Hurry up. I guess you're in a hurry. Um, I guess let's turn off the audio just so I don't get hit for music on YouTube. Add up a little bit. And I switch back and forth between controller and keyboard just because, like, driving with analog is a lot better than driving with keyboard. Even though I know you could do it with the mouse, but it's really terrible. Like, it doesn't keep moving when you do a direction. Like, I wish it would stay where... Like, if you move your mouse to the right a little bit, I wish it would keep turning right instead of just, like, turning a little bit and then stopping and going back straight, so then you have to move your mouse back and forth. Hey, look, a Zentorno. One of the fastest cars. Other than the adder in the game. Haha, <laughs> check that out. Train had to, wanted to get by, but all the cars are in the way. But well, we got a green light, people. Let's go. If I could honk, I'd honk at you. I suppose I'll turn off the jobs menu for now just to make the HUD a little smaller. I'll turn that on every once in a while. Take a peek at it. Oh, come on. Drivers are worse than my local area, man. These guys are terrible. Come on. I hear a blinker or am I just hearing stuff? Oh, that's the truck's blinker. How can I how come I can hear that? Taka taco. Oh, if only I could go rob that truck, but I don't want the cops after me. Are they not able to go because of that train me in there? That's crazy. Oh well. Oh god. This guy's nuts. Yeah, so let's drive under the truck. How about yeah, there you go. Good job. Let's not drive under the truck. Oh my. Come on. Oh, and a disclaimer now, I guarantee I'm going to be getting pissed sometime in this game. Just add something. And I will swear, so it's, it's on you. Viewer discretion is advised. I obviously put that in the comments. Or not the comments, but the description. And, uh, you know what? Screw this. I'm just going to get out because it's right there. I got the cops after me, though. I don't care. I got the real life mod set up that, like, doing anything bad actually comes back at me. It's just not during missions, but we're not going to be doing missions because we're going to be doing jobs. And then running around the city and buying stuff. And maybe stealing some things. Who knows? We might end up buying or selling one or two things or might end up selling something we stole. Who knows? Let's see how it goes, because this mod is pretty crazy as far as I've seen so far. Done, but whatever. Oh man, I gotta go in the legit way. Oh well. My camera's so far away, jeez. Oh yeah, first person. Yeah, let's not do that. Okay, so what is this job? I bet you it's pilot. Yeah, you gotta have a degree. That's pilot. All right, I guess it's down to airport security. Is even farther away now. Apparently, there's a strangers and freak mission there. Whatever. Uh, this is this is on my like 60 something percent. Like after the story's done, with a couple missions done too, just to just to have something to play when I'm not doing like modded stuff. I do have a 
100% save, it's just I don't really play it, because obviously, you know, 100 cents over with, so... Nothing really to do on a- You asshole! Really, dude? You, did you not see me walk in here? Yay! Watch it! You guy's gonna do it too. Look, even the, even the walk light's on. This guy's just go right through it. Whatever. Other than getting a getting a job and getting some money, I think one of my biggest goals will be to get a damn pistol. At least have something to defend myself in case some mugger or something comes after me. Which I which I'll add a uh, mod for that tomorrow or next next video. I mean, after this one, I have it. I just have to tweak it a little bit because some for some reason it just doesn't like to work sometimes. Or it could have just been because I was playing Franklin. I don't know. But, um, it's random, random encounters, basically, like, people come attack you. Random attackings, I think, is what it's called. And props to the mod makers for this stuff. This stuff is awesome, and this game would have been boring a long time ago after I completed it 100%. Still working on some of the achievements, though. Especially with online. And if you're here, you're probably you've already watched my lowrider DLCs, all my uh, Lamar missions on that that content with with some of the other random crap we've done in between. And then my last my last big thing with GTA was a stream. If you guys want to check that out, all that should uh, pop up on the on the video here for uh, what is it called? Um, one of the cards to show off the playlists and. The other games. Oh. But yeah, apparently there's only seven. There's eight jobs total, but seven of them are fully working. The, the like I said before, the fireman or firefighter one at the station. It's ten bucks an hour, but it's like. 70 or 80 bucks a day or something like that and you have to actually drive around that one is completely broken apparently i watched some people try to do it and they can they can do the job and drive around oh bus should have looked both ways my fault uh they could do it they could do the job but all they get to really do is drive around they don't get to like put out fires or anything it does change their skin for it though but that's like it but otherwise, you don't get to do anything. Oh, look at all these nice cars. Might have to turn into a serial killer. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. That might be that might be something I'll do on, like, the last episode or, like, episode 10 or something like that. If I get that far. Depends upon how far I get with this series, because it'll be pretty difficult to do all this and actually provide uh, commentary the whole time. Usually I don't. This is, like, the first time I've actually sat here and talked to myself, basically. But this one seems pretty fun, so I'm I'm a little excited about it. Might even do some streams for uh, some of the other big mods that don't take, you know, a week or two to complete. The Bagasi. <laughs> some of the conversations in this are awesome with the real life mod. I didn't do it. Oh shit. Going down up in here. Alright, so here's the terminal security basically. If I get the job. Hey, I got the job. Alright. So let's go to work for a night. And yeah, that's a little uneventful. Okay. <laughs> I thought it was actually uh Oh no, I gotta give that money back. Did I, did I actually get it? Yeah, I did. Oh my god. Alright, so I made one day's paycheck of $84, so... The mod here to deduct the money was, um... How much was that? Oh, crap. Ew. Come on. 138500 Okay. Negative 5... 
There we go. Alright, back down to $84. Perfect. Oh, I gotta get out of the menu. There we go. Back to another day of work. One more. Actually, I suppose I should look at how much, like, the cheapest vehicle is. And see how much I actually need to make here. What day is it now? Tuesday. It's only been two days. Yeah, I think technically I could do that mission, but I'm not going to because I'm doing some other stuff here. Off my back. Alright, so I, I suppose let's start start with like a thousand bucks and then work our way somewhere else and see what else there is to do. I I would I actually you know what? I'd change my mind. I'm gonna I'll probably end up do, trying to do like all the jobs because I know the pilots require doing the, the college, but I don't know how much that costs. And then the taxi driver requires a special license, which also requires going to the college and I don't know how much that costs. But I think the first thing is to get a primary means of conveyance. In other words, a vehicle of some sort. So, yeah, I suppose. All right, let's look at the phone. See how much I need. Can yeah, I get out of here? All these messages. All right, so travel. Right price. 5000 for the scooter? Really? Okay. How about... Uh, boat would be useless, plane would be too expensive, any of this st this stuff would be terrible too. Even Yeah, it's like 200 grand. Um, how about, a, how about a, like, nice bike? Oh god, 40 grand? How about a bike bike? Thousand dollars, 500. Like an all-around mountain bike, I guess, and this is a BMX bike. They're decently fast. This would probably be one of the better ones to get, but I'd rather get one of these right now just so I have something. Alright, so they're going to send me an email. And there it is. Alright, so now I can go pick up my bike. Go through these so I don't have the notifications in case I get something. From a job or something like that. Oh, forgot to do my... Oh, yeah, that's a good job. Good job there, Michael. Nation is packed. Alright, that's all of them. Sweet. Okay, so I got the bike. That's supposed to go somewhere here, or oh, that's that. Never mind. That's... Is that where it's supposed to come out? Build all that. Nah, I'll do that off camera. Whatever. That's a long ass way to go. Get a taxi. Taxi. How much money do I got? 100 bucks. Uh, get a little bit more. Let's get to a thousand at least, just so I can buy something. And then I'll get a taxi, and we'll head up, head up to get the bike, and then we'll go to the college and see how much that shit costs. One thousand. Hey, oh look, taxi. Hey, pal. Taxi. Oh, that one. Here. That guy must have had somebody in it. Here, dude. Get a ride. Where can I take you? Catch a ride. Uh, yeah. West Let's go there. Right away, sir. And hurry your ass Come up. On. Get the lead out. Because I'm not paying for it. Hurry.
I suppose if anybody's wondering what kind of hardware I'm running here, it, um, eventually I'll get a link to my overclock.net profile once I um, rebuild that rig to what I actually have, because the one that I have on there is like a year old, a year or two old until I upgraded to what I got now. I'll put those in the description of this video and then future videos, and I'll probably go back and do it for my old ones too. I've seen a lot of people record this and they don't even do it at 60 FPS, they do it at like 30 or something. This is only a part time gig. I'm Let me know if 60 is like place. way better looking too. I hope that ain't money. Oh, good. Answer the phone. Awesome car, man. Awesome car. I'm in a taxi, you moron. Alright, so I suppose I'll end this episode when I get my bike and head out to the college, and then maybe... Uh... Do a class or something if I got enough money. If not, I'll try to, um. I don't know. Try to get something else going on that I kind of want for one of my goals. You're looking good. Shut up. <laughs> but real life interactions from that mod, it's stuff's weird. Kind of funny, actually. I suppose I could just skip these in future videos, but since I have to ride a taxi, might as well just do everything legit with no skipping. And no cuts either. I don't cut my videos usually. Sometimes I do when it's like, it has to be done, but not all the time. Most of the time I just sit there and talk to myself. Except for my lowrider streams, because that required, you know, online with people, and, uh... Using some kind of VoIP, not the end game, because the end game's terrible. Almost there. Almost get to see my new bike. Oh god! I would have laughed if you hit him. Oh jeez, God, man. Learn to drive. That hobo car. Freaking Prius with crap on top of it. Are you serious, dude? You can't, like, run through the light because it's a turn lane? Ah. Uh, come on, come on, come on, come on. And I don't know why it still says $84 up in the top right. That might just be the way the mod is. I don't know. But we'll see. Ah, there we go. I forgot to turn that on. I forgot the job. And there's a quick look at it while we're sitting here waiting for the damn taxi to move. And the light to turn green. And all the idiots to get out of the way. Eh, I'll just leave that on. I'll probably forget to turn it on and off later. Get him. Get him. Alright, I'll just get out here, dude, because you're you're kinda being here you go. super. Oh, and I forgot I legitly had to pay for that. <laughs> How much was that? 36? That's it? Weird. I expected it to be like 100 bucks or so. Into the garage. Wow, that's awesome. There's nothing in here. Come on, Hobo Joe. Up to the college. Alright, so now I'm going to be using a controller so nobody freaks out about why it's like really weird all of a sudden. Uh, let's go up to the college and see how that works out. As long as I don't get hit by any cars. Wait, I'm on a bike, right? I could ride on the sidewalk, can't I? I don't know, we'll see. There's, apparently you're not supposed to ride a car on the sidewalk, but I don't think this is considered a car. That was an Australian guy. <laughs> Funny. 
Oh god. Uh oh, somebody got hit. Should have snap a matic that thing. So everybody could have, you know, peace of mind for me helping them out when they got in an accident. I hope those NPCs don't try to come and kill me right now. That'd be terrible. Alright, we're good. That's a nice car. I wish I could find some cops just to see if this is illegal. I don't want to ride in the sidewalk and then end up with like two stars or something and have them come kill me. Also let me know in the comments if you want me to actually turn off the HUD except for like when I need the map possibly or I mean I could leave it off completely just for like if I get the cops after me or something so I can't see my health and I can't see if how many stars I got and all that and if I'm like out of their view range I'll just have to play it by ear and if they don't go away they don't go away cutting through cutting through oh god you're the idiot that ran over me or hit me I got in front of you it was Get a camera and headphones on, that's cool. Is there a bike rack somewhere? No? You know what? Here's a bike rack. I'm just gonna make one. Right there. Perfect. Take the helmet off. Not on the bike anymore. Take the helmet off. There you go. We're on. Why does my camera always go like really far away? Alright, so what's this? What's this here? Oh. Driving course. So I guess that's the taxi license. Well, whatever. Might as well get it. Hi there. How you doing? Two in-game hours. All right, sweet. So I guess we'll just do all this, and we have to do it legally too. So I'm not gonna pass anybody, and I'm not gonna um like run red lights and anybody stuff. Out there good for no, I'm busy right now. Driving around for two in-game hours. Oh, hell. Is that going too fast? Get it. You got there. Oh, can't pass. Red light. Oh wow, he stopped after the line. How did I get an off-road warning? What the hell? But no, I just has to stay up. How the hell did I get an off-road warning? I didn't go off-road. I was on the road the whole time. Whatever. Hey, I'm looking for a pickup. Anything going on? This is dispatch. I got a job going right now. I'm on it. Ah, oh, I'm not taking it. Uh, dispatch. Scratch that. I'm going off-duty. That is like the weirdest mechanic ever. Honk your horn to take a job. Instead of, you know, using like an in-game computer or something like that. Or using a different key. Oh god! Oh god! That would have been bad. I'm on the road! I'm on the road! What the hell is this shit? Oh my god. Oh my god. Really? I can't be that close to a car? That's what got me the warning. Oh my god, that's so stupid. Whatever, this is fun. This is fun playing legit. I don't know how long this video is going to be either. If it's like a half an hour, it's going to be crazy. Somewhere around the 20 minute mark right now. I don't know. I'll have to do a timer next time. Come on, dude. i got to drive around for two in-game hours. What time is it anyway? Half after midnight. How long does it take? Oh, that was one minute. This is going to be a long drive. Is that a hooker? That's a hooker! Hi, beams. Find your ass. I just hope you have proper hatred for yourself. Look, if I offended you, I'm sorry. Call just came in. Who wants to do a pickup right now? What? Oh. 
You define everything no! that's wrong with this place. Oh, shit. Okay, so apparently I'm yelling at the car in front of me. They actually replied. What is that guy doing? Passing. Passing that mofo, because he's too slow. What's the speedometer at? I don't even know. Come on, green light. Let's go. When I say you suck, I mean you really suck. <laughs> Michael, you're such an ass. Fuck off. I need a driver for a pickup right away. Oh crap. Uh, I failed. Yeah. I failed. Did I lose all my money? Yeah, damn it. Alright, well I guess that does it for this video. I failed the damn driver's test. <laughs> I'll do it in the next one. Thanks for watching.